Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Wakarkadash. In the heavenly Father, true name is Yahweh, and his only begotten Son, Bahashem, and name for Mashiach, Yahweh Shai. Those are their true names in the ancient Paleo Hebrew, the last one can ask the whole tongue, and I say Shalom. In the heavenly Father, true name is Yahweh, and his only begotten Son, Bahashem, and name for Mashiach, Yahweh Shai. And shalom to the uh, elders Wa'akim uh, Wa'akwaf once again And I say shalom and This is a uh, sit down lesson Of Arabian uh, Arabiannews.com And it reads It says uh, Iraqi Nujaba Says it will continue to attacks On US forces it says parts of Iran's so-called axis of resistance, the Umbrella Group, has claimed more than 150 attacks on U.S. forces in Iraq and Syria since the uh, Gaza War began, updated on February 2nd, uh, 20, 2024, by Reuters as of February the 2nd, 2024. The Iranian-backed uh, Iraqi armed groups in the Juba said on Friday it will continue launching attacks on U.S. forces in the region until Gaza war ends and U.S. forces exit Iraq. Days after another major Iran-backed group said it was suspending such attacks. Uh, Iraq's shadow Keltabuk Hezbollah said on Tuesday it would pause attacks on U.S. forces, a decision that followed the killing of three U.S. soldiers in a drone attack in Jordan near the Syrian border that Washington blamed on Iran-backed militants. Washington has vowed to retaliate. New job of leader Akram Al-Kabat said in a statement he understood care about uh, Hezbollah's decision, but New job of and other factions in the Islamic resistance in Iraq. A umbrella group of hard-line Shia militants will continue operations. Part of Iran's so-called axis of resistance, the umbrella group has claimed more than 150 attacks on U.S. forces in Iraq and Syria since the Gods of War began. Iran denies direct uh, involvement. Iraqi officials fears Washington's response to the killing of its soldiers could be severe and along with Tehran pushing Ketubuk Hezbollah to stand down sources told Reuters hoping it could be helped the escalate tensions was highly unlikely. It says Iran President Ibrahim Razi said on Friday that his country will not start a war but it will respond strongly to anyone who tr tries to bully it. In 2020, the U.S. killed Iran Quad Force Commander Kwasami Salamali and a Kaitabek Hezbollah leader Abdul Madali al Matadas in a drone strike at Baghdad Airport. The strike came days after the U.S. blamed Karabouts Hezbollah for the killing of a U.S. contractor. This is a uh, second edges 15 verse 15. For the sword and the uh, destruction draw off nine, and one people should stand up and fight against one another with swords and hands. It's the book of uh, Prophet Joel. Three and verse nine proclaim ye this amongst the Gentiles, prepare war. Wake up the mighty man, let all the men of war draw near, have him come up. Joel three and verse ten. Beat your plowshares with the swords and plenty of hooks and the spears, and let the weak say I'm strong. So with that, hopefully this uh sit down lesson.
Both of his uh, sit down lesson was uh, edifying. Uh, this recent news article from AirNews.com. Iraqi Nujaba says it will continue its attack on U.S. forces. So with that, hopefully this uh, lesson was uh, edifying. With that, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai Ba'ashem, Makar Kadash, Shalom to the uh, elders of Aki and Ba'akwaf. I say Shalom, and the Heavenly Father, true name is uh, Yahweh, and His only begotten Son, Ba'ashem, and the name for Mashiach, Yahweh Shai. Those are their true names in the ancient Paleo-Hebrew, the last one, Kadash, the whole time. And once again, Shalom to the uh, elders, Wa'aki and Wa'akwaf. Until next time, I will say Shalom.